Welcome to the joiner safety video. Today we're using the Morrisville High School Delta 6 inch joiner. We can use this machine to smooth out warps in the faces or to straighten an edge. Number one, do not join stock shorter than 7 inches. If you're using a larger joiner, I would recommend using a larger piece of wood. Examine your stock for knots and defects before running them through the joiner. Number three, never permit your hand to pass over the cutter head. That is the fancy name for the blades beneath the guard. Round stock should never be joined on the joiner. Avoid downward pressure. Use sideways pressure. Don't force the workpiece. The guard must be used at all times. Use a push stick or shoe when joining narrow boards. Do not join end grain or cross grain. The outfeed table should not be adjusted by students. Turn on the dust collector when using the joiner. And remember, if you make a mistake on the joiner, the wood can be replaced, your fingers cannot. So I have this piece of walnut that came from the sawmill. It's rough sawn right now. It hasn't been surfaced on any of the sides. There is a knot here, but it's a hard, like, secure knot. It's not loose in any way. But it makes me think I'd rather join this face. So I'm going to lay this on the joiner like this. I'm going to pass it over the cutter head using the shoe when I get towards the end. And I'm, even though I'm going to be holding the board in place as I push it, I'm going to move this hand around the knives, around the cutter head as I cut. As you could probably hear, there is a little warp to this board. It cut a little bit here and a little bit here. So we're going to give that another pass and see if we can straighten this out a little bit. I did make a cross cut at the back end here. I think it's going to make the shoe hook on it a little bit nicer to make it a little easier on my second attempt. My board is making some progress. I'm going to switch over and straighten this edge first. I think that might help me with pushing it through on its face. much straighter edge. It's not perfect. I'm going to go back and try and fix in that face. I'm back with my walnut board here after it's been through the planer and the faces have been cleaned up. Now I really want to fine tune this edge because I can hold it up straight to my fence, keep it nice and square, and get that edge looking really good. 